Bronx United State. What's going on? I guess my news is going on. What's going on? You guys are good. Hope you guys are safe. You can actually tell them today. I'm about doing um, on demand work. Right about. Hey, how you guys doing? A quick video. Um, you guys waiting around for on the phone. You went to get some work on the app. Were you guys waiting on the courier company that you got that you on with right now to call you because they got you on standby all morning. You know, it's 10 o'clock in the morning and you're still wondering if you're going to make any money today. Listen, I urge you to go out and start working on getting your own clientele your own own business it's very simple very simple pound some ground go out get in front of these people it could be any type of business all types of businesses need your service go out get in front of them offer your service your services i just got a direct thing with a corporate office in my area that I actually went to them. This is how I got it. I was at the post office sending some packages and there was a guy that went to pick up some 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 mail for uh, this company, this this corporate office in my in my area, um, which is a bank. And um, he goes there every morning and picks up the mail for the post office and uh i was chatting with him and he's like yeah i'm the one i've been driving coming here i hate coming here you know and i was like yo have you guys ever used a company to go out and pick up the mail every morning because i did that before i i used to do that i did that for a big hospital in my area i'll go in my van and literally pick up like 20 bundles packs of uh, uh totes of mail uh, from the post office that was full of the hospital because the hospitals use PO boxes but they don't put them in a the box they just stack them in these bundles and I just pick them up, pick them up every morning so I was like have you guys ever used that he's like no but here call this person because this guy's older he hates to have to go pick up he hates to have to stop at the post office bring them in you know he hates that so I called up he gave me the person to call I called them and guess what who's going to be the person picking up the mail Every morning for the, for the for the bank, this person here, okay? Because everywhere I go, I always got my eyes open. I always try to find that opportunity. I always talk to people. I'm also trying to get on, trying to deliver some generators. I go to a generator company, and I'm trying to get some work with the generator company delivering their generators to the client's house or delivering the generators to the sites, to the to wherever they need to be installed. Because, you know, they sell generators. So somebody buys a generator, the contractor doesn't have to go and pick up the generator. You know, I can put the generator in my van and deliver the generator to the site, to the customer for a fee, you know? So it's a, it's a local generator company. They service, they sell. I'm trying to get with them. The only thing is the generators don't fit in the van because the generators, when the forklift picks them up, it picks them up sideways like this. So they can't put them in the van, no matter if they do side door or back door, because they have different size generators. So the only way they can fit them in the van would be the long way, but the forklifts, the forks don't. So um, if I get the deal with them, I'm actually gonna buy me a, try to get, get, give me a little flatbed pickup truck so I can put the generator on the flatbed and deliver them open cargo because they deliver them open cargo because they, they come in crates. But anyway, what I'm trying to tell you is you can go out there and try to get your own, try to get your own work. Don't depend on apps. Do not depend on on courier companies because at the end of the day, these courier companies do not care about you. I work for so many of them and they're gonna keep, they will cut your price, they will cut your price, they will cut your price to you stop complaining and then they'll, they'll say your route ended and the, oh, they got rid of your route and then you, you they'll fire you and let you go and then they're gonna have someone the next day do the, do the route for, for less. So while you're out there working for these people, keep your eyes open. Try to get your own little thing. Even if even if the pay is not all that good, but you get your foot in there, right? You know, it gets better. It gets better. That's what I do. Right now, I it's five past ten. 
I just dropped, dropped off some stuff at the at the laundry mat. Laundry mat, right? I gotta be at the warehouse by eleven. I'm gonna be done by two thirty today. That's how much time I'm putting in. I got people working for me that work five hours a, a, a day, and my wife says I'm paying them too much, and I pay them good. They work for me. I supply them to a company. They work for me, right? Because the company we do the work for does not want the liability because it's a liability. Every time a company sends their driver out on the road to, to deliver, it's a liability. On top of the liability, they gotta pay fuel, insurance, vehicle, vehicle maintenance, social security, taxes, 401k. They got all these things they have to pay, hourly wage, all these things they have to pay, all that stuff adds up. So you gotta go in there and say, listen, you have to get rid of this, 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 and, some, and the more important thing they have to get rid of is the, the, is the liability. The liability, an accident, they can cause an accident. You don't want that liability. A lot of they, a lot of people nowadays they like to smoke, right? This is what happens. It's legal in a lot of states. It happens all the time. Their employees get in an accident. They have the drug test, the the, the company drug test. They find marijuana. Boom! It's even a bigger liability for the companies. So they don't want they don't want that liability. They want to pass it on. So that's when you come in. You got to get in there. You, the only way to get in there, you got to get in front of their faces. You got to get in front of their faces. Okay? What do you need? Basic stuff. Get yourself a nice cargo van. Nice clean van. Clean up yourself. Clean van. Cargo insurance, at least 50000 Get a commercial policy. And that's it. You need commercial policy for cheap. Last one that I have for cheap. Um, progressive. Commercial vehicle. Cargo insurance, 50000 You're golden. You don't need an LOC. None of that. Get in there, and if one stuff starts rolling, and you want to get an LLC to protect yourself, if you can, but make sure you get a liability insurance, at least a million dollars, cargo insurance, and you need um, commercial driver, I mean, a commercial uh, auto insurance, okay? But you got to get in front of these people. You got to get in front of these people, okay? I'm going to be putting the live together, and I'm going to have a list of places where you can actually go and get in front of their faces and try to get your own work. It's not going to be easy, but once it pans out, you're going to be golden, okay? These apps don't care about you. You're going to sit all morning, 10 o'clock rolls by, 11 o'clock rolls by, 12 o'clock, and at, by 5 o'clock, you only made $120, and you spent all day on the phone waiting for a job to come through the app when you could have spent all day on the road prospecting, all day on the road knocking on doors, all day in the road, all day calling people. You can walk into a, a, a warehouse, you know, and say, listen, I was just taking care of a client next door on the other building, wondering if you need anything. We're here all the time. We're here picking up stuff to deliver. So we just want to add some stuff to, you know, add some stuff to our, to our roots. Um, do you guys ever need anything? If you if you do, here's my number and whatever, yada 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 yada. Fully insured, I will be able to offer you uh, insurance. I can, you know, the obviously gonna you can get them an insurance certificate, um, so they can feel a little bit more at ease. But you have to go out there and pound, 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 get your work. These companies out there, they do not care about you. The current companies, they do not care about you. They don't care if your kid's sick. They don't care if you if you're struggling. They don't care if you can't pay your rent. They don't care. You got to go out and get your own, you know, set yourself up. All right. I'll talk to you guys later. If you made it this far in the video, I want you to comment in the comment section. If you make it this far in the video, get your own hustle. Get your own hustle. Okay. Comment that please in the video, in the comment section. Get your own hustle. Please don't forget to subscribe. Hit the notification, hit like. I will put a video. I'm going live soon this week, at the end of this week. Stay tuned, so hit the notification so when I go live, you don't miss it. I'm gonna be having a whole list of places you can go to and people you gotta see when you get it there. All right, I'll talk to you guys soon. This is your independent contractor channel. Peace, bye-bye.